Good afternoon to one and all. My name is Shri Saya. I am working as assistant professor in MVR College of Engineering and Technology in ECA department. Now I am dealing with the subject random variables and stochastic process. This random variables will be used in communication purpose. Why? Because in communications we will deal with lot of noises as well as this stochastic process means this stochastic process we will be used in the accounting purposes or some research purpose we can use this stochastic process as well as this random variables if you take the FM radio if you want to tune up from one channel to another channel in between these two channels you will encounter an noise that noise can be removed not so much but by using our theories as well as principles we can reduce it at most as possible the main theme of this lecture today's structure just an introduction what is meant by random variables and stochastic process and what will be the text books will be there how to follow up the things and finally we can put it here you already learn about the probability in the process and there, right? There you can see lot of problems on dice as well as cards. In the same manner, here also, first topic introduction will be there. After introduction, we will see the probability, some more problems of probability. Next, we will move on to the random variables. In this random variable concept, properties will play a crucial role as well as different different density functions will be there. We have seen that density functions in the latter section. The main aim of this subject is to reduce the noise in the communications or whatever it may be. Why? Because in the next semester you will be dealing the subject or tackle the subject like analog communication after second year, third year will be starting, you will deal with the digital communication. In that communication part, this random variables will play a crucial role. Without this random variables, there will be no communications. As well as, in present semester, you have the signal and system subset. There also, some concepts will be touched up by using this random variables in stochastic process. In there, like um, correlation and auto correlation with the cross correlation, some of the concepts will be there. I will be teach each and every concepts to you. Don't worry about that. This lecture will be just like an introduction lecture. How this subject will be there? What will be the future scopes? and what will be the main important concepts as well as what will be the in-depth of this subject we can deal in this session this RPSP subject that means random variables in stochastic process is like a mathematics subject this subject will be Purely mathematics, same like M1, M2, like that. 
we can follow the problems, conditions, as well as properties and their proofs. In the next lecture, that means next class, I will be telling you the that syllabus five years. See, I think five years now. Yes, five years. Five years syllabus will be there. I will be explaining to you five years syllabus. And next, after that lecture, we will see the three months and two months as well as seven months important concepts for the RVSP subset. After that, we will read the first unit that will be the random variable. Okay? Now, you can see what is meant by random variable. Random variable means in the real industrial purposes, if you give in the input in between some process will be done, after you will get the output. In between the input and the output, in between the process will be there. In that process, you will get the some more errors and some some noises will be getting by means of the room temperature or whatever it is. Our main aim of this subject will be to reduce the noise as much as possible. Really, we can reduce the noise fully or absolutely 100%? No, we can't reduce the noise 100%. We can't. We can't do it. We can do it by making some of the assumptions and uh, making some properties and apply the mathematical analysis to it and we will follow the reduce the noise up to the 40% to maximum only 60% why because we can't predict the output first 10 minutes the output will be like this after 10 minutes output will be changed we can't the change the output. That's why this subset will be an basic crucial role in the research purposes as well as industry oriented subject, mainly in the stream of communications. Before move on to the random variable, let's see the concept of probability. You already know the probability, right? Probability means if I give the dice, if I give the dice to you, if I make like this, some students will be telling this will be 1, 2, 3, 5, 6. Different students have different thoughts about this. Die. If I just make roll it, the die ones, it will be 1, 3 will be happen, 5 will be happen, 6 will be happen. We can't predict before the output. Same. If you see the cards, total there will be 52 cards, like playing cards. In the playing cards, you, you also cannot encounter some of the problems like you can't predict the output that will be then A or King or Queen, Joker, whatever it may be. You can't predict the output. In this way, we can see some of the probability here the main after the introduction 
the probability will be there. It's like a review for planning variables, the probability. In that probability, we will see yes, dice problems as well as cards problems and years, how many leap year as well as uh, different different problems, years. Next, we will see the this events sample space, sub sample space set. We will see all of these problems as well as review for the probability. That will be the first unit for you. And next, we will start our chapter that will be the random variable. So here, if you want to know the subjects or main textbooks for this RGSP main textbooks. Probability comma random variables and random random signal principles by Python Z tables. In the Google you can also search like Probable random variables and the stochastic process tables. You will get in PDF that textbook one I can follow and I can follow the two textbooks. I will be tell the two textbooks and as well as the reference books. And next textbook I will follow that will be in engineering mathematics textbook. Engineering Mathematics by Grebel Grebel and next you can see some reference books or reference textbooks that will be the reference books RBSP Random Variables and Stochastic Process by Sean Southern Shams of Clem, RBSP by like uh, introduction to uh, random signals and communication theory, introduction to random signals. Communication theory. By B. P. Gatti. These textbooks will be efficient for you. First textbook: Probability, Random Variables, and Random Signal by Pebbles. I already sent it to you via 
वाट्स नेक्स्ट इंजीनियरिंग मैथमेटिक्स बाय ग्रेवर दीज टू विल बी द स्टैंडर्ड टेक्स्ट बुक्स दिस सब्जेक्ट आरबीएसटी सब्जेक्ट इज मैथमेटिक्स सब्जेक्ट फॉर यू डोंट थिंक लाइक दैट विल बी इन कोल सब्जेक्ट सेम व्हाट विल बी देयर इन एम1 एंड एम2 सेम लाइक दैट ओनली इफ यू वांट द डिफरेंस व्हिच मींस आर वी जस्ट बी गोइंग एंड वी विल सी स्टोकास्टिक ग्रुप इन शाम साउथ लाइन यू कैन गेट द मोर नंबर ऑफ प्रॉब्लम्स इन द शाम साउथ लाइन इफ दीस थ्री टेक्स्ट बुक कांसेप्ट्स विल बी नॉट सफिशिएंट फॉर यू then you will move on to the next subject that will be the introduction to random signals and communication theory by dp lati this is also important subject or oh, this is just like a reference textbook for your or this subject and before before we move on to the probability concept In the next class, I will tell you the syllabus for this random variables in stochastic process subset. Here you can see the one variable random, one variable now, one random variable and two random variables. That will be the multiple random variables and their characteristics. As well as properties, you can see all of those things in this random variable and stochastic process subset. This will be the introduction for a random variable subset. If you have any doubts, you can ask me in the comment section. I will be. If you have any doubts, means I will be teaching to you one more time. I'll, or I will be just like clear the doubts for you in the next class. We will see the syllabus for the random variables in stochastic process. This R is the subject. You have the credits. That means you must assuredly pass the subject. You will, if you pass the subject, you will get three credits. Don't worry about the subject. It's very really simple mathematics subject only, easy subject. Don't worry about that. Next, you will see the. Five units in depth, and finally we will start the probability. And before the class, I will teach you the what will be the three marks and seven marks concepts will be there. Then we will see the probability concepts. After the probability, we will start the random variable. Then we will process the required units in the further session thank you